upcycling, or creative reuse is the art of taking materials that would otherwise be headed for the landfill and <laughs> making them more beautiful or functional. I love upcycling for three reasons. The first, it reduces waste for our planet. The second, it helps us exercise our creative mind by challenging us to think outside of the dumpster. And third, I've always loved to craft. Today, I'm going to be showing you one of my favorite upcycling techniques. It's called decoupage. Who here has done decoupage before? Wonderful. For those of you who haven't, I think you're in for a treat. I like this craft because it is simple, inexpensive, and you can do it on a wide variety of materials. I've decoupaged glass jars to make candle votives and also gratitude jars. I've decoupaged furniture, wood scraps to make wall art. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to decoupage the buttons that you'll find in your bag. Does anyone have one of these laying around? Well, if you do, and you're not too, no longer keen on the messaging, why not remake it into something you're proud to wear instead? To decoupage, you need a foam brush and decoupage solution. You can find this at craft stores, or you can make it yourself by watering down Elmer's glue. Three parts water to one part glue. You'll also need the object you're going to decoupage and paper. Paper is something I think that we all have plenty of laying around. You can use newspaper and magazine clippings, discarded books. And today I'm going to be using paper that I designed on the computer and printed out. Once you have your materials collected, you want to paint a thin layer of decoupage glue on the surface. Put your paper on top, and this is a good time to smooth out all the wrinkles and make nice clean edges. Then you'll want to add another layer of glue on top. And allow it to dry. Don't worry, it will dry clear. And that's it. Easy peasy.